Hello guys, Rated here again, and uh, I thought I'm gonna be doing now a highly requested tutorial brought from YouTube and my Discord, and that is how to add patterns to a retail kit uh, generator. Well, this is how it's rather simple and easy, nothing really to advance in here. So, say uh, everything I have, let me just is from uh, a retail kit generator, latest version. Uh, so patterns you have done all the patterns from the internet that I got and then you got uh, other patterns that I purchased so I can share with you guys and I opened buying a pattern not sure from which year and you, you just copy and paste and then we want to resize it now Like this kit generator is not really perfect as uh, it's meant for beginners, it's not really meant uh, to use patterns or it's not really meant for patterns but I guess if you really want to use them using this generator you do it like this so as you see now it's really too big, you can see the co uh, color, you can see anything so you just I guess cut it because that's how you do it pretty much you just cut you can do that by selecting with your right mouse and delete but uh, the simplest way is to use a pen tool so like this you can use pen tool I'm not doing it perfectly now but I'm just showing you how it can be done you know and then uh, on pattern you can as well uh, go here in this normal and then you can change it to what you like you can even go in color I don't think you can I guess this particular pattern you, you can change the color but uh, mostly others you can let me open something else uh, let's open this with stripes a lot of people ask me how do you add stripes so you have stripes there already or some of the stripes are in there in uh, patterns provided so same as uh, the last one you just make it fit as you think it should be and yeah, pretty much you just mark and so and delete the part you, you don't want and then uh, you pick a pen tool and you go around around the color make selection and delete so again it's patterns aren't really meant for this uh, generator but I guess if you want to do it uh, you need to do it this way Another way to make patterns is you just uh, open a new layer, you press M or selection, right click and you just draw like that. Let's say I want a black pattern. G and I paint. And then if you want your next uh, stripe to be the same, Control and G to copy. You can drag, Control and G. Oops. Control, wait. Control and G to get another copy, and then I want to merge those three so I can move it at the same time. And by the way, a lot of the patterns you have in Photoshop already. So if you're like bored to have uh, things like this, like blank, if you zoom, you you, you don't see anything. You can go double click patterns. And then you see here, you have like so much to choose from. Like so much options. This is like really ugly, but if you scale it, scale it like this, it can be... Oops, it can be rather good. Now you have like many other options as well. So if you zoom in, 
you see they get like that nux texture so that's pretty much how you can use patterns then same for the back paint uh sorry you use pen tool you, you, you use the mouse and in other download the patterns uh same process pretty much uh, this pattern is from Vol's uh, current home kit from 2020-21 season. I really like to use this one actually. I used it in so many kits. Uh, so same process. You make it fit as you think it's perfect. And then you just use pen tool to... I guess I need to rasterize it first. There we go, now we can delete. And then this pattern, this particular pattern, you can uh, you can change the color. Uh, so say... Like darker red, something like this. This is really cool, huh? So you can make it like that and then you just clip it like and paste it make it fit and that's it and one thing that's really important to know when you add patterns to your kits you don't really need to add it to to the coif itself it's not really necessary um and then you, you can do the same process adding patterns to uh current ea kits or ea textures and then it's the same process pretty much so yeah that's it i hope you learned something today if you need any help or have any questions ask me either in the comments but the easiest will be to come to my discord and ask there because i'm much more active in, in there link uh, or invite code is in the description thanks so much for watching guys and see you at the time bye bye